Good day everyone. Today we are going to deal with one of the contemporary American author. John Barth. He was born on 1930. He is an American writer. He is known for his postmodernist and metafictional fiction. Metafictional fiction is a fictional work that reminds the readers or audiences to be aware that they are reading or viewing a fictional work. Now, let's see about some of his works. The Floating Opera, 1956. It was first published in 1956 and later it was revised in 1967. It was his first published work. The plot revolves around the existentialist and nihilist story. It's a first-person account of a day when protagonist Todd Andrews contemplates suicide. Existentialism is a philosophical theory or approach which emphasizes the existence of the individual person as a free and responsible agent determining their own development through their own acts. Nihilism is the rejection of all religious and moral principles in the belief that life is meaningless. His next work is The End of the Road, 1958. It's his second novel. It was published first in 1958 and then in a revised edition in 1967. It's the irony-laden black comedy. The protagonist Jacob Horner suffers from a nihilistic point of view. There are lots of similarities between the floating opera and the end of the road. Both were written in 1955. Both are philosophical and straightforward realistic novels. The floating opera deals with suicide, while the end of the road deals with abortion. They are available together in a one-volume edition. Barth remarked that they didn't know they were novels. His next work is The Sot, Weed Factor, 1960. Initially intended to be a part of trilogy with the first two realistic novels. But it got developed into a different project. The title is taken from the poem, The Sotweed Factor or A Voyage to Maryland, a satyr, 1708, by an English poet Ebenezer Cook. His fourth novel, Giles Goat, Boy, 1966. It's a metafictional comic novel. His next work is, Lost in the Funhouse, 1968. It's a short story collection. It's a metafiction, and it's extremely self-conscious. His next work is, Chimera, 1972. It's a novella collection. Novella is a short novel or a long short story. It's more metafictional. His next work is Letters, 1979. It's a novel in which Barth interacts with characters from his first six books. That's it for today. Hope you all found it useful. If so please remember to like, share as well as subscribe to my channel. Meet you all in my next video. Till then, keep learning and growing. Let's grow together. Thank you.